boom, 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 boom. Gonna shoot you right down at all your feet. Y'all got your nice little domestic family house here, and you've uh, invited uh, beatniks in to do something gargantuan. <laughs> and it's like, uh, my name is, well, never mind what my name is. I am here in a subterranean catacomb kitchen deep beneath Gastonia, North Carolina. We are crossing over the Rubicon. We are making the forbidden, the taboo, Boudin, wow, America. This, you cannot buy at Costco. This is what, it's not satanic, it's actually healthy for you, but this is pure, uncoagulated pig blood, and this goes back to the Middle Ages when we first made blood sausage with this. The USDA will not allow you to buy possess, taste, transport, or anything. I've crossed the Rubicon, man. I got damn hot blood. Forbidden ingredient. This is what limey's made. Okay. First, you gotta have a cold beer. And then, we're using the, uh, the blood and the uh, stock that we cooked all the pork in. And now I'm gonna put uh, long grain uh, rice. And when it gets to the top like that, that's a two to one ratio of liquid to the rice. And no matter how much uh, liquid you got in there, that's how you know. Except that it's got the forbidden uh, pig blood in it. This is not for children. Only consenting adult. I need uh, some uh, uh, green onions cut up and some of the uh, celery tops. And it be... It's really hot stock. And this is what we use, Carolina Gold, made with the, uh, from the loins of African Americans from Senegal that came to South Carolina. And that's why we have the Citadel here in South Carolina because well, I'm not going to go with there, but that's it's not an accident that the war started in South Carolina. Yeah. Spaghetti. Before there was Tupperware, when Lewis and Clark crossed America, they had to preserve and hold meat, and they didn't have plastic. Plastic hadn't been invented, but intestines and they made boudin out of buffalo intestines. And I'm not making this up. Fresh pig blood that you can't buy anywhere in America. But you can't in your percent meat. Greenery, spicy. It's a Cajun, part of the Cajun lore when they came down from Arcadia. Now we're adding the meat. Of course, Lewis and Clark didn't have a KitchenAid, but what they did have was Indian lady. The, the buffalo intestines upon the horn, it was by firelight, not fluorescent light like we have here. And you see how it looks vaguely sexual over here, but it's not. This is where I mean it's sexual. Don't it look like a hot dog sausage thing, like we know what we're doing? You can uh, put a, a, a pan on over there yeah. and uh, just put some water uh, to kind of steam saute them. Where? Looks like right there. A, uh, a full condom. I hadn't really thought about it like that, but you know it's not. I need more rice. But... Hey, 
come on man, this ain't potted meat. This is nature's bounty. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's the same thing the bowls do. Yeah. And, uh, here I am. It's been a long journey tonight. From the slaughterhouse this morning at dawn's early light till right now near 10 o'clock in this underground boudin parlor that we're at. Don't try to recognize me because I'm not here. What woman could not uh, turn this down? I mean, if I came into the boudoir looking, smelling, being this, uh, if I was a woman, I'd be all over it. Beast outside. We got enough boudin to stretch from here to Gaffney. That's Cherokee County. They don't know about French stuff like this. <laughs> oh, really? Good, yeah. good. You don't want to time in knots. No, that's what I'm saying. You got oh, 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 okay, okay, you okay. Drop and cold. <laughs> oh, I thought you were You're just fine. Joke. No, like seriously, if you don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not